Welcome back to Bandalord with the Garburator. I'm the Garburator. This is episode six. If you haven't watched episodes one through five yet, you might want to go back and watch those first. This is the second time I've started a game in Bannerlord. We've decided to start as the Kuzates this time with our character, the Garb. Last episode, we're still trying to collect prisoners for one of the villagers in the Kuzate Empire. They offered to pay us money for every prisoner we bring. We've already brought them 21. We have five in our party right now. And now we've run across this pack of 26 looters, which we're going to take on and see if we can get a few more prisoners. This battle is a li- going to be a little tougher than the ones we just fought because they outnumber us. But let's see how we do. The goal, of course, is to try not to lose any men at all because uh, we are actually starting to see some good levels and some good upgrades. We have a few level 5 guys. Oh, this is a very wide open map. Let's see, the enemy will be coming over there. Should we just stay put then? Or should we maybe try and climb to that tree, top of that ridge line? Let's send our guys to the top of the ridge line. Loose formation! Form a shield wall! There we go. Sorry. For those who don't know, I'm playing on Xbox, so if it seems a little shaky, that's why. I don't have a computer mouse. I'm using (laughs) joysticks. Let's do line line formation, but we'll tell our mounted archers to go over there. Oh, these guys are only 105. Soldier forward! Soldiers there in shield wall. Archers in the back, mounted archers over here. Move! They are not as far away as we were. Okay. Actually, let's change our plan. Change our plan. Change our plan here. They're all way too close. Move! So, Move! put our archers back here. Let them do some damage. Not looking good this time, folks. Because there they are, right over the hill. Right already. Oh, good. Our mountain archers are doing their job. Let's go and draw some of these guys away from our infantry so they have a better chance. Good. Footman! Everyone charge! We've actually lost a uh, troop. That's not good. Oh, they're fleeing in fear. Good. Chase them all down. There we go. Got that looter. Oh, he's wounded. Good. That'll be a prisoner for us then. Whiff. Not another whiff. Seven damage. Not great. Whoops. Well, we'd be ahead of that one. Kind of wanted a prisoner. How many are left? There's one left somewhere. Well, we're going to get four prisoners out of this. Let's go see if we can get that last one. We can just wound him. That would be the best. I can't even see him. He's over there the way our mounted archers are surrounding and circling. Oh, there he is. He's just running up that hill. Oh, this is a long ride. Oh, I'm not going to bore you guys with this. We'll just let them do their dirty work. Oh, there we go. Battle ends. 21 dead, 4 wounded. We're going to get 5 prisoners out of that and some more leveling up. That's good. Oh, they had 200 coin. So let's uh, let's level up all these guys. That's good. We have a bunch of mounted archers who need a higher level of horse if they're going to level up next. So I think after we trade this in, we should hopefully have enough coin that we can uh, go and level up sooner rather than later. There's also a hideout over here, which means the surrounding towns will hopefully pay us to go and get rid of it. But challenge with the hideouts is uh, 
you need some higher level troops to attack it, or you just lose all your men. Okay, let's go trade in these men. I think that should bring us up My to, greetings to you. 31, 31 prisoners. Yes, sir, I've brought you a few men. There we go. Yep, that's 10 more. Perfect. Well, we only have about a day left, so let's end our business and see how much he's willing to pay. There we go. 775 gold. And we got two skill points for charm. That's not bad. Byproduct. This place has 441 gold that they can sell, so we'll sell them everything we have. If they have enough, they may not by the looks of it. That's good for us. Okay. And then we need to go and... Nope, they don't have enough gold left, so we'll take all that. There we go, we finished that quest. 31 prisoners traded in for 775 gold. That was a pretty good quest. Okay, we did lose one troop. So, let's go and recruit somebody so we can start leveling them up. Who do we have in as an option? Oh, we actually lost two, it seems. So I can go for two more mounted uh, noble sons, Kuzate noble sons, or I do need more infantry. So I think we'll just go with uh, two infantry. They're a little cheaper too, which will be nice. And I can sell the rest of our stuff here. They have a thousand gold to sell. There we go, 35. None of these are better than what we already have. Same with the weapons. Most of these weapons aren't any better than what we're already using, so we'll just sell them off and get some coin. 500. Rusty Falcon. That is pretty much equal to what we're already using. So we'll sell that. 760, that's good. Okay. Well... Let's go to this castle and see if anyone needs our help with any more tasks. See if we can uh, make some more money from any of the lords inside. Nope. Apparently, this lord doesn't need any help. I. We'll talk I anyway don't think and say hi. We need to build relationships. I would like to enter the service of Khan Mon Gu. Well, it's a little early for us. We don't have much of an army. So let's not enter that service yet until we have a few more men are leveling up. Okay. There are all these steep bandits in the Kuzate territory, but they run very fast. Speed of 6.6. .6. We actually can't chase them, and we can't catch them, so... With this hideout here, let's go to this village and see if we can, uh, if anyone would like us to deal with that hideout. Why do something for free if you can be paid to? Wow, our soldiers are really, uh, Peace to you, stranger. Good. It's costing us what 142 gold to have them. I hear you have a problem. Having trouble with bandits, but recently we've had more than our share. The hills outside the town are infested. Depends. How many men do you think are required to get the job done? It's asking us to hunt down two bandit brigades. We can do that. And we'll get 550 coin. That shouldn't be too hard. Now, what I do with these is I just have them follow until we get close to an arm close to somebody and then tell them to charge. Again, the goal here is to try and not lose any men if we don't have to. Well, we've awakened. Oh. Yeah. 
we go. We've gained a level. Nope. Oh, shoot me, not my men. There we go. Another marauder down. That's a good start. There we go. Okay. Who's next? Let's go inside this cave. There's five left. Come on, guys, keep up. Some of these hideouts are complicated, others aren't. The ones in the forest tend to be the least complicated ones. There we go, I'm not alone anymore. Oh, that wasn't too challenging. Okay. Oh, behind us. There we go. Okay. Well, let's go deeper in. Hopefully this isn't a dead end. Ah, oh, the usual question. Left or right? Let's go left. There's one. Now, for those of you who haven't played Bannerlord before, at the end of hunting these guys down. We'll end up having almost a, like a boss battle against the bandit leader. So, there's only two left. Let's run up this hill and we'll probably end up in that fight. Yeah! Oh, Archer again. Ow. Uh-oh. Deal. Help me, men. Thank you. There we go. Okay, so we cleared out the cave. We cleared out to the right. The only place left is there must be one person left to the left to the less left of us. Let's see. Oh, there they are. And this is probably going to act as the leader. Ah! Ah! Well, that works. Yep, here comes the, here's the boss battle against the leader. You're giving you, a choice. You Do you want to fight? You sweat through my men there, damn one you. One on one? How about we settle this one on one? Fight duels with, uh, against them all. Ten to five odds is probably better. Fighting one on one, especially since I've already taken so much damage, I don't want to lose in this. So, let's just have a fight to the end. We'll let my guys do some work. And they can just kill him as well. Perfect. That was the best. We lost no men. One of our members upgraded. Oh. Which is good as well. And we killed 12 of them. Took two prisoners. Also good. And we got some extra horses. That horse is far better than ours, so let's take it, see if we can use it. <coughs> Pardon me, that'll help. And then maybe we can get, use these to upgrade some of our troops. And that's the hideout. That also finishes up that mission for ourselves. We can go get our 550 gold. Oh! We didn't even have to go back and talk to him. He just automatically sent it to us. That's And uh, we're all out of time again, so I guess we'll end episode six here. Again, if you like these, stick around. I'll try to keep posting uh, every day or so one of these episodes. And uh, look for, out for episode seven. If you haven't seen the others, go back and see what happened before this. And have a good one. See you next time.